Hello. Today's session is very easy and interesting. Sometimes in data analysis, we have to solve the simultaneous equations. It's a school level problem. We solve the simultaneous equations by elimination method or by using matrix. We use Kramer's rule and solve it. But with Python, we can do it with just one command. But we will have to import SkyPy and from SkyPy, we will have to import LinAlg. People have worked a lot on Python. They have developed many functional packages. We use them. So we import NumPy as NP and we import from SkyPy. We import lin alg. Say algorithm. We will run it if there is any issue. It has come up. Now we have to take two variables. Let me see. Let us see this p. P is np dot array and p will have three arrays within the arrays. So this is one, this is the common, we will start another bracket and we will write it here as 6 comma 3 minus 2. Then we have second array. Second array for this 2, 1 minus 1, 2, 1 minus 1. And again the third one, 5 comma minus 2 plus 3. 3. I repeat 6 3 minus 2, 2 1 2 1 minus 1. We are just taking the coefficients 5 minus 2 plus 3, 5 minus 2, 3. And then we have got another array q is equal to np dot array, and this will be only. 43 comma 16 comma minus 1. So we have created it. Now we will tell LinAlg to solve the problem. So let us say our say our answer is R. R is equal to LinAlg which we have already imported from SkyPy dot solve P Q and then we will say print R. That's all. Run it. Your answer is 4, 3, minus 5. You can check it manually, but your program is okay. So it is 4, 3, minus 5. X is equal to 4, Y is equal to 3, and Z is equal to minus 5. For instance, in this case, 4, 2 are 8, plus 3, 11, minus, minus 5 is plus 5, 16. So this answer is coming correct. I repeat the commands import numpy as np from skypy import linal 
then you have to create this array from the equations p is equal to np dot array 6 3 minus 2 2 1 minus 2 1 minus 1 5 minus 2 3 and uh, your next matrix is 43 16 minus 1 r is linal dot solve pq you can change this pq or you can have any kind of letters you can use it and then you will print r thanks for watching wait for the next video where we are going to test the hypothesis one sample test two sample test and then pair t test and all other further tests thank you very much